the topic which we'll discuss today is psycho and whether you should consider it or not if you like our videos then do subscribe to our channel over the past few years scaling blockchain has been an important step now networks like polka dot offer faster confirmations enterprise level reliability support parachains and layer 2 networks open access nodes are required to keep them decentralized but as the cost of running these networks is going up a few volunteers are providing open access nodes a couple of operators dominate the public blockchain for instance infura dominates the ethereum ecosystem these networks don't have a way to provide infrastructure if the private sector can create a business model then that model can only pay for it but remember the most profitable and attractive business model creates centralization and monopolization cypher solves this for you it has an application stack that pays participants not for staking or mining but for user facing infrastructure there will be money to run the necessary infrastructure as long as there are users for any parachains or blockchains now let's discuss what is cypho i am rajpan and you are watching total crypto cypho is delivering an open internet one can run cypho built blockchain apps in their browser without non open infrastructure or close plugins additionally it rewards its nodes to run the equipment to keep other networks free and decentralized benefits of cypho the first one being powerful blockchain it supports data intensive apps like games and social media two open infrastructure it pays for infrastructure that connects blockchains to users the network deploys more infrastructure when more applications run on it 3 polka dot ecosystem it provides full support for polka dot and other leading web3 blockchain 4 web d app platform it provides an easy to use d app platform so that developers can immediately get started 5 browser support Cypho apps run directly in the browser without closed plugins or private API providers. Six, anti-monopolistic. Shortage of connection points is not there because anyone can start a node, and access points make money servicing users. Last but not the least, it is open source. It is a decentralized open source software stack powered by a stylish and economic design. Talking about its investors, in 2018, Cypho closed a $2 million deal in seed round, backed up by sophisticated blockchain investors in Asia, including New Global Capital, Ion Blockchain, Feng Shui Capital, BCH Angel Fund, Fission Capital, among others. Tokenomics. To take part in the Cypho ecosystem, users need Cypho tokens. the ticker for which is SAR this tiny fees all together produce the economic incentives for nodes to provide infrastructure for other parachains and blockchains users can purchase SAI to participate in the ecosystem but in practice most users will not need to spend money on cypho applications as cypho apps run directly in the browser users can receive passive tokens by installing the application for instance an advertising module that shows advertisement on the cypho application without tracking it is the approach for er eradicating monopolization pressures on the web3 layer connectivity providing nodes cannot prevent users from installing revenue generating application take away just as proof of work incentivizes mining and proof of stake incentivizes staking cypho incentivizes the running of open network infrastructure it is a simple yet smart solution that fixes the economic problems 
in all proof of work and proof of state class networks so cycle becomes unlike any other blockchain that exists so far looking at the structure and applications which are presently up and running cycle is a generational shift in the blockchain technology one should definitely look into it if one does not want to invest in it then it is worth using their applications to in- earn incentives in the form of passive tokens keep watching total crypto for more such videos thank you